So last you probably saw, I was on my way into Yellowstone. Well, I went in, I got my uh, pass for the week. Um, I got all my literature, things to look through for places to stay and things to see. However, the closest uh, site that I could have gone to that would have had availability was 50 miles away in the park. In addition to that, there wasn't a sure thing, so they said call ahead, but there isn't service for 20 miles. I had a little bit less than a half a tank of gas, and the sun is going down in the Shoshone National Forest, which is this road that I took that snaked all the way up to the east entrance. I ended up uh, seeing a ton of sights, but none of them allowed tents uh, because of grizzly bears. Grizzly bears are not like black bears. They attack whether or not they're hungry. They're not afraid of humans. They're much more aggressive and less predictable. I'm exhausted. So I've been riding all day. I, uh, I thought it was a smart decision to not try to go in because it was gonna get dark. Riding around in Yellowstone in, at night, riding around where I live, the worst that you can run into is deer. <laughs> There's way more than that there. So what I did is I backtracked and I went back. I got back on the bike, turned around and headed out of the park and I came across several different campsites. All of them said no pop-ups and no tents. So, where am I now? You guys aren't gonna be happy about this. I'm not camping today. I am on a nice little creek in a cabin. Here it is. This is my own little home. It's made for people much shorter than me. So this is where I will be staying tonight. It's got more than I need. What I'll be doing now is uh, I might make a few phone calls, but they have to be by landline. There is electricity, I believe, in here. Other than that, I'm good. I'm fine. Nobody knows where I am. I am... I just kind of like that feeling, but... I am not in Yellowstone. I'm not in Pebble Creek campground where I wanted to go. I, I beelined it to the nearest Yellowstone uh, entrance, the closest one I could get, and it was still 50 miles from the nearest campsite. I'm gonna keep myself entertained with the Yellowstone literature and figure out what to do and see. And uh, more than anything, I'm, I'm gonna eat. Sorry, I'm, ca I'm not camping. I know this is a moto camping channel. This is a travel channel as well. I can make up every excuse I want, but um, I'm not happy about it either. I really, this is past Jimmy screwing over present Jimmy by not doing enough due diligence and research on creating reservations, nor planning. I am obsessed with so many things while I travel. Like I like to stop here, stop there, look at this, that. How much am I gonna get under this season? What can I videotape? And in the process of doing that, there are valuable minutes being used while I'm doing that, that I could be used traveling toward the destinations that I'm pitching for. But I, this is where I thought I would be, right? At, you know, I'm next to Yellowstone. I'm just not in it. So uh, geographically, I'm not that far off. Um, all I have to do is just load this onto my bike and move it. So I'm doing all right. <laughs> 